Welcome, uh, welcome to our English uh, grammar lesson, tag question. And all Islam along with Afghan Tazanul Islam at your super duper channel, Lysiam Bangladesh. That's it. First of us, you uh, first of you tell us uh, what is the correct uh, tag ending for this sentence. None of us attended the farewell party yesterday. None of us attended the farewell party yesterday. Was any? No. Did any? No. Uh, well, right. uh, that's it. Uh, now you tell us uh, what is a tag question. In a tag question, the speaker makes a statement, but is not completely certain of the truth. So he or she uses a tag question to verify the previous statement. Great. Uh, sentences, doesn't you know, sentences using tag questions should have the main clause separated uh, from the tag by a comma. Uh, that sentence will uh, always end with a question mark as it is a question. And, uh, you know, there are some rules about uh, tag questions. We use the same auxiliary verb as in the main clause. If there is no auxiliary, we use do, does or did. If the main clause is negative, the tag is affirmative. If the main clause is affirmative, the tag is negative. Well done. Yeah. And uh, we don't change the tags. That's it. Now uh, look at the sentence again. None of us attended the farewell party yesterday. So you see, here is no auxiliary verb, and the sentence is affirmative sentence and uh, a simple first tense. So none of us attended the farewell party yesterday, did we? I couldn't agree more. And that's all for today. If you like this video, please make sure to subscribe for more. Adios.